my name is Emily. And my name is Nicholas. The theme we chose to work with was how does music affect. The project was conducted to find out how music will affect plant growth and concentration. Normally we won't think about how music affects us, we just think that it's something we enjoy listening to. But we wondered to that is why we have chosen this topic. We did two different experiments. One with plant growth and one with concentration. The first project was done by playing classic music by one of the plants every day. The other one was done by testing some students. The thing about music is that it's not only love, the sounds and beats, but sound waves. Pressure from sound waves can create vibration, which is able to speed up seed germination. Plants does not hear the music, it just picks up the sound vibrations. First, we'll talk about the plants in the procedure. Many experiments have been performed by both scientists and students to prove that plants can grow better and faster when they get stimulated by sound waves. Some of these experiments have shown that some plants grow more quickly after being able to get musical stimulation. Most professional scientists will agree that scenes that are exposed to music will actually be able to germinate faster. There are also those who have the opinion that plants that are exposed to music may in fact be receiving better care and attention and therefore grow more quickly. When someone speaks or sings to plants, they may possibly be supplying with the plant's normal carbon dioxide, which the plant needs and able to grow faster. We planted the plants 14 days ago. Every day we watered, measured and played three hours of music for them each day. The plant that shouldn't get music was removed to another room, room when the music was playing. It didn't really happen anything the first three days, but on the fourth day, the music plant started to sprout. With time, the plant was tallest. So the thing we did was place soil and ready seed into two separate buckets. Every day when I got home, I would water the plant with the same amount of water, of course. And right before I went to bed, I would measure them and note down how much they have grown. At the end, we made a diagram of the information and printed it out so we could put it on the board. We found out that it actually worked. The music plant was tallest, bigger, and grew faster. So we ended up having a successful first experiment. But then we wanted to do an extra experiment, so we thought about using some students from the school. When we got to the part where we needed to have some students, um, we decided that they were going to play a concentration game. First without music and the second round with music. The things we used to do this project about concentration, I believe, were one boy and one girl from 6, 7, 8 and 9 grade. A computer, internet access, and the online concentration game, earpods. Um, one out of eight of those uh, students chose hip hop music. Two out of eight chose pop music. One out of eight chose heavy metal, and the last person chose classic music. Then we asked the person if it was harder or easier to focus with music in their ears. Sixty-two percent thought that it was easier to concentrate when they had music, and thirty-eight percent thought that it was harder. So it's very different from person to person. We took one boy and one girl from 6, 7, 8 and 9 grade. We needed to see if the boys or the girls concentrated best when they have music in their ears or did not. The results is the same if you look at the time um, they used. Half of the girls and half of the boys had the same results in the time even though they did not choose the same music. That again proved that it is very different from person to person, which music or without music they concentrate best to. When we thought of this concentration game, we decided that we not only wanted to focus on our age, but wanted to focus also younger and older than us. We wanted to know how your concentration ability reacts when it listens to music. The difference between just sitting and making homework in silence or making it with music is of course different. The way the brain reacts when you listen to music can be different from person to person. If you are that kind of type that listens to music that brings memory up or something else, you often are relaxing when you're listening to it. If you listen to hip-hop music, you may in fact like to sit and make some moves or signs with your feet. As you may already know, you react different in, the mood, in your mood and other from the music that you're hearing. The quickest of the girls' game without music was done in 1 minute and 26 seconds. The slowest was done in 3 minutes and 26 seconds. The quickest of the boys game without music was 1 minute and 39, 49 seconds. The slowest was 2 minutes and 20 seconds. But when they got music in their ears, it all changed. Uh, one of the girls got a whole minute quicker because 
she got music in her ears, but someone else got slower. A student needed a minute and ten seconds more to complete the game. So again, this proves that it's very different from person to person. We hope that this experiment could give us more precise answers. So the conclusion must be that music does affect some things. We are amazed by the fact that the music plant actually grew faster and actually got taller because of the three hours of music every day. It is also great to find out that our experiment worked, even though the, uh, the first project was more successful than the other was. And now we would like to thank Ellen for helping us with the things we forgot and also for some maps. And we would like to thank Michaela for giving us the opportunity to do this science fair. And we want to thank my parents and Emily's mom for supporting us and helping us with the planned project. And of course, Nicolina and Jesper from 9th grade, Lina and Patrick from 8th grade, Sarah and Lasse from 7th grade, Maria and Umut from 6th grade. Thank you for being experimented. And last but not least, thank you all for listening. We hope you enjoyed and we hope you all gained a lot of new information.